Hello friends, here's a quick and a very very easy mnemonic to understand the PARC 3 step test. Just remember the mnemonic that is TONE GOS, T-O-R-N and G-O-S. So what do we need to do here is first identify which side is the hypertropia. Second is to identify it is getting worsened on which tilt and which case. So if it is getting worsened on opposite tilt, so remember it is TONE, tilt opposite is our rectus. It's going to be rectus muscle. If the tilt is the same side, getting worsened on the same side, then it is going to be a oblique muscle. Second is gauze. If the hypertropia is getting worsened on the opposite gaze, gaze opposite, then it's a superior muscle. If the gaze is same, then it is inferior muscle. So that is how we identify whether it is rectus or oblique, it is superior or inferior. Now next comes the final step is to identify whether it is the same side or the opposite side muscle which is affected. For that, identify the muscle that you have got from tone gauze. Is it a depressor or is it an elevator? If it's a depressor, so examples of depressor are inferior rectus and superior oblique. Then the muscle affected is the same side as the hypertropia. Otherwise, it is if it is an elevator, elevator has O in it, not S. So it is the opposite side. Depressor has double S in it. So it is same side. So let me give you a quick example here. And this is the most common query that I get for the PARC 3-step test. Here is, there is a patient who has presented with the head which is tilted to right side and on examination there is left hypertrophia which is increased on looking towards right or medially so what is the muscle affected so first of all understand that when they give you that the patient is presenting with the head tilted towards right that means this is a position where the patient is seeing better that means actually it is getting worsened the diplopia is getting worsened on the left tilt and they've given you that there is left hypertrophia so first step, the hypertropia is on the left side. It is increased on looking towards right or medially. That means the gaze is the right. So left hypertropia, gaze is opposite gauze. So remember, this is superior muscle. So we have ruled out option B and option D, which is inferior. So we've got this is superior. Now you can see from the options here that both the options are saying it is oblique muscle. So we you might not go for the tilt as well when you have to answer this question. But let us see how this is oblique muscle. So Head tilted towards right side. That means the patient is feeling better here. That is how the patient has presented. So it is getting worsened on the left side the tilt. So left hypertropia getting worsened on left tilt. So the tilt is not opposite. So it is not tone. It is not rectus. So it is going to be oblique muscle. So that is how we have got it is superior oblique. Now we have to identify it is right or left superior oblique. So the superior oblique muscle is a depressor. Depressor SS is same side as the hypertropia. Hypertropia is left side. So the muscle affected is also the left side. So the answer is going to be left superior oblique here. So your homework now is now to practice questions on the part three step test and let me know whether this trick has helped you to understand easily the ever confusing part three step test. Thank you and keep following for more such tricks and mnemonics with Dr. Nikita.